Hey there, Guilty Gamers, it's Claire again, and we are back to Subnautica. I would have had another video explaining what I did between the last video and now, but I tried recording that and it didn't record the whole screen right, so now um, I'll just show you everything I've done. So, um, I completely forgot that my base was relatively set up, I at least had food and water, but now I've expanded upon it. Um, in short, this is going to be the the bottom three are the peepers and the air sacs for food and water. This is going to be where I'm putting uh, most of the hostile creature eggs, the carnivore eggs, like um, sand sharks, uh, ampules, blah blah blah. And then over here, that's going to be my growing chamber. Down there is the basic like operations room. And then these top layers are going to be the living quarters. Off of the food area here, off the second one, I'm going to be putting my moon pool. And then off this one of these two top ones, I'm going to be putting the scanner room once I get those. So, um, holy crap, already? So, I think all that needs to be done right now is a little bit of exploration. Um, tell you what. Let's go... Actually, let's go this way, because I think the moon pool... I think the moon pool's in the mushroom biome, but I'm not entirely sure. So let's go this way! And, um, to elaborate more on what happened to my other recording, I had it fully recorded and I was ready to edit it, but when I dragged it into my editing program, I realized that, like, the bottom corners, like the right side and the bottom of the entire screen were cut off. And I was like, God damn it. So now I have to record the whole thing again. And hey, that bug is gone that was that I encountered in that recording that doesn't show up. There was floating debris. Uh, it was like floating above the ocean. I think it was this crap. Yeah, like this stuff was floating above the ocean. I should really make that lead suit. Whatever. I'll be fine. I just need to keep an eye open for radiation. That might be the next thing I do after I tool around in the mushroom biome for a little bit. Is uh, go fix up the aurora. Because I do know of the secret entrance. There's a super secret entrance. You don't have to go all the way to the front for it. You don't have to deal with as many freaking crabs. The ship has crabs, everybody! It's really gross. Jeez, where is this mushroom biome? Um, it's 60% energy. Carp. Ha! <laughs> Carp, because it's fish. It's funny! Shut up. I'm hilarious. Bone sharks! Lovely. Terraformer. Propulsion cannon. Propulsion cannon. Oh shit. Oh crap, it's empty. There's an engine fragment. You know what? I ain't having that shit. So, um, I don't think I want to deal with the bone sharks right now. So where the hell's this mushroom biome? Oh, I'm gonna get some of this. Hell yes. Magnetite. This stuff is the best. Magnetite is my shit. Mostly because I use it's used in like literally everything. Everything I like about this anyway. 
um, namely the compass and the uh, the blah the compass and the thermal intake power generator yeah that thing huh I wonder if there's any stalker fangs stalker boo you having a problem there alrighty um, ba -dum, ba -dum. there's a lot of scrap metal here but I am determined to go make rude I was talking shit everything I need is that direction in the Grand Reef it's in the Grand Reef god damn it God fucking damn it. Um, that's okay. If I can get more lead, how much lead do I have? I think I have enough to make a rad suit so I can go ahead and just patch up the Aurora. I also need to make a beacon. I need to make some bacon. Bacon would be really helpful. What's over here? Oh, hey, what's for lunch? Uh, dinner. Chicken and pork, barbecue sliced beef, baked beans, ham and cheese. Everything except for the baked beans sounds delicious. Oh my goodness, I love barbecue. Uh, sides include a baked potato, coleslaw, mac and cheese, garlic bread, and a biscuit. Everything except the coleslaw sounds good. I dislike coleslaw. And I, I'm sure some of you are yelling at me, Claire! How the fuck do you not like coleslaw? I just don't like coleslaw. I don't like baked beans or coleslaw. I was raised in the south and I don't like baked beans or coleslaw. I'm, I'm an anomaly, I know. Alright. You know what? I think I have some stuff in the hatch in here. So I'm gonna go grab that. Oh yeah, now you guys get to see the inside. So yeah, that's my front entrance. It's like a nice glass corridor because of course. Um, here's the creature, cre bleh, the creature containment center, the triple C, the CCC, in the CCC. I'm so sorry. Please don't hate me. Oh yeah, I found a duffel bag. So yeah, that's a thing. Uh, what do I need for the rad suit? Two lead and. Two fiber mesh which I get from creep vine samples so I have two lead and I can just go in my CCC and get some of this ah my inventory is full ow I got stuck on a ladder put away all this titanium this titanium what do I need for fiber mesh two creep vine samples so I was right Alrighty, gonna get one more. Hopefully this doesn't kill it. Okay, good. Gonna go ahead and put on my rad suit. Once I make some fiber mesh, and then I make the rad suit. Then I'm gonna go fix the Aurora. Cause I am tired of radiation. Sick and tired of radiation. Alrighty, hell yeah. Take that off, put that on. Boom, now I am rad vincible. Oh, I am going the wrong way. Here's the Aurora. Hopefully I don't encounter any Reapers. Cause that would suck. I'll be right back once I'm closer to it. See you soon. Alrighty guys, so we are coming up on the side of the Aurora, as you can see, and I'm sure everyone knows about this, but there's this little crevice about halfway up that is strangely open. So if you come to it, and you dip down, I'm going to turn on my lights so I have some light, rumbly rumbly. I also recently picked up a fresh battery. So, let's go up and through. There we go. 
Alrighty, this brings us directly into the core of the Aurora. Ah, here we go. First one. Seventy, eighty, ninety, done. Yes, I know. I'm working on it. So once once these are all patched up, um, radiation dissipates over the course of three in-game days. Got to watch out for the bleeders. Eighty, ninety, done. There's one. How many are left? Thirty, forty, fifty, six, seventy, eighty, ninety, done. Four left. Some more air. There's one. Aha. I knew there had to be at least one more underwater. Hmm. I think they're randomized because I don't remember all the locations, or if if they're not randomized, then I'm just really bad. Um 70, 80, 90, done. 56, 70, 80, 90, done. One more left. Oh, yeah, this is here, by the way. The power efficiency module for the Cyclops. There it is. How did I not see that? Thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, ninety, 80, 90, done! Radiation dissipation within three days. Please stand by. And then you can just go right back down this hole and back out. Yeah, glitchy ass signal. Alright. Now that that's all done, I should be safe. Relatively speaking. And now, uh, I need to go make a compass so I can actually track where I'm at. What do I need for a circuit board? Or a computer chip. I need silver. Pick that up for nothing. I'm gonna keep that on me. And I have zero silver. Yay! Crap. Well, I'm gonna go grab some acid shrooms to make a um a thing for another thing. I'm going to need four of these. Oh, my inventory's full. Go grab another one. As well as maybe like a peeper and an air sack while I'm down here. What's my inventory looking like? So I'm going to make that two peepers. Oop! Shut up, coffee pot. Two peepers in an air sac. I completely forgot my coffee pot was on. I just had a nice cup of it because I woke up this morning and I was tired as hell. Alright, now I've got some food and some water. Glub glub. Make this. No. Oh. Oh yeah, I had batteries already. Duh. Make another battery at least. Oh yeah, my coffee pot. 
Speaking of coffee, I'm gonna dump this thing right here. Yeah! Now oh, it looks like shit there. Right here. Yeah! Coffee! Coffee, 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 coffee. Jump, 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 jump. I kind of like the gentle roar of the um, thermal vent outside. It's so nice. Welcome aboard, Captain. Alrighty. So, um, actually, I think that's all the time I have for this episode. I spent all of it sealing up the Aurora. So, uh, thank you guys so much for checking it out. Don't forget to hit that like button for me. And share this video with all of your friends and family. Make everyone a guilty gamer. This has been Claire over at Guilty Skies Gaming, and I will see you all next time. Signing off for now. Bye bye, guys. Thank you.